Hey guys, welcome back to AwesomeDrills.com. I'm Tony with Mr. Gary today. This next drill is called the switch up. So what you're gonna need are cups, cones, plastic bowls. You know me, I like to keep it cheap. So we got the plastic bowls. You can get a stack of plastic cups, 20 of them for a couple bucks. What you're gonna do is have basically two lines. Let's say eight feet apart. You can do 10 feet apart, you can do 20 feet apart, whatever you wanna do. You can keep it even smaller and have it a little faster. So we've got six bowls here. You can put more if you want for the sake of filming. We're just gonna leave a few. So I'm gonna be right here in the center and let's say uh, we're gonna divide the, our class up into a few different groups. And I'll show you another way where you can keep the energy, the momentum going. Nobody's waiting around too long and you can have one line going. So starting off basic, the whole concept is to take all the bowls from this side and put them on that side. So if I'm going by myself, um, and you're gonna let the student go all the way down and complete the whole task. Uh, definitely only keep like maybe five or six bowls to make, the, to make it go faster. So I'm starting in the center, I'm gonna shuffle. I'm gonna squat down, grab one. I'm gonna shuffle to the other side, squat down, place it down. I'm going back and forth here until I complete the entire set. Once the entire set has been switched, the next person would go and they would replace them. So they would come all the way back to this side. Ready and go. Great leg workout. Good for agility, speed, cardiovascular. So whatever the theme is in your class, you can make this drill work for it. So now let's say you've got 10 kids in line and you wanna run one or two lines. Maybe you don't have a whole lot of room. I'm starting here. I shuffle, boom, put it down. When I get to the third one, the person behind me goes. So as he's going to one side, putting them back, I'm taking them, putting them to the other side. And then once he got to the third one, the next person would go. So it just can be continuous like that. Keep it going, Gary, keep it going. Pretty simple concept. Now, if you're running one line, you can keep these closer together and put a lot more all the way down. So that way, just imagine, by the time the first student gets all the way down to the end, all you're seeing are just kids back and forth, back and forth, back and forth, switching sides. Pretty cool, a lot of energy, a lot of variations for this. Come up with some cool ones. I'm Tony with Awesome Drills. We'll see you.